Hi, my name is Karen Sun. I'm with Talking the Five, and I am here with some high schools from Apache Junction High School, the vice president and the president of the student council. And tell us what you're doing here today. We're painting a house for the Rock and Roll Paint-a-thon just for community service, just because we want to give back to our community. And who is the lucky contendent tonight or today? Uh, it's uh, randomly selected throughout the, the program. And this guy, he's a veteran. He's a really nice guy. He's come out and we talked to him a little bit. And it's just nice to like get to know to all of them because we do this every year. Oh, so. yeah, great. And how many students do you average doing this? I'd say around 20. Mm -hmm. 20. And then uh, not all of them are from our council. Our National Honor Society, they uh, need community service hours. So they love to come out here and help us. Well, now, how does someone get involved with this project? It's mostly just volunteers. If you want to get involved, just you can, I guess. <laughs> but would you contact uh, the student council of Apache Junction, or, or um, how does anyone, or how does someone like even get to uh, s submit um, a request or um, a, or a, a nomination, as so, so to speak? Um. Well, our student council advisor fills out a form to participate in the the service that runs this, and if we get accepted, we get to paint a house for someone. Well, how does uh, how does the how do you know which house to do? Um, well, they contact us. They contact our advisor, and then she tells all of us if we want to volunteer to show up, we can show up and paint, and then we tell the other um, the other clubs like NHS and such if they want to come help us too, they can. I think it's great. Were you, um, was Apache Junction selected or did you guys volunteer to do this? Uh, we volunteer and then uh, not everyone that submits a form gets accepted, but we did and we do every year. So. Well, that's great. It's uh, nice to see that uh, you guys are out there not just, uh, you know, doing bad things. You're all doing good things. We have good teenagers out there and we like to let people know when you guys are doing Wonderful things for the community. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, my name is Karen Sunt. Here, let me take my sunglasses off. I really don't need them right now. Anyway, we are here in Apache Junction, and we just had a bunch of teenagers uh, paint his Ray's house today. This is Ray. Hi, people. Ray, say your name and and Ray one more time. Ray DeWitt. And tell us a little bit about yourself. What do you want to know about myself? Well, you the the kids recognized you as a uh, 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 one of our vets. Uh, I served uh, six years in the United States Coast Guard. I was a W four warrant officer. I was a helicopter pilot. I flew sea rescue missions in Vietnam. Uh, I retired in '04 from civilian life. Uh, moved here. My wife passed away in '09, and I've been here since. And uh, you, did you lose your... No, my leg I lost. Uh, I, they went into my left leg to remove a artery to put in my right. It went south. I got gangrene and they had to remove it. And then I was in a coma for six months. And the place I had before, it was sold. So I had to buy this place when I got out of the convalescent hospital. So it was kind of nice to have someone come and help you out, at least no. with the paint. It was tremendous. I just, I'm, I'm ecstatic about and so elated about what they did, I just couldn't believe that they picked me out of I don't know how many people. I still I still feel that there are other people more more needier than I was, but I certainly appreciate what they did for me. And as I've told everyone, I just can't believe how beautiful those children, well not children, teenagers were, that what they did and how polite they were. And they did an excellent job, by the way, as well. Well, and Lisa, you got in, how'd you get uh, Ray involved in all this? I seen an article in the newspaper, and it was a rock and roll paint-a-thon, and they gave some of the criteria to meet, and so I went and printed off the application, and I had to keep kind of pushing him to get it filled out, got it filled out, and I had to keep pushing him to get it sent, and I said the most they can do is say no, that you weren't selected, but he was selected. Well, that's wonderful, and... The the organization I talked to the lady that was in charge. What do you remember her name? No, I don't. I'm sorry, but I I know that she uh, uh, teaches. Uh, I believe it's civics or I believe it is civics there at the high school. Well, that's good because we do need people, you know, wanting to be leaders in this country. Don't you think? 
I do, and I was impressed with all of them, those children. As a matter of fact, the uh, the one little gal is working, is going to be an attorney, so, and I think they all have, uh, are going to aspire to be professionals. Well, kudos to them, and, you know, it's nice to catch a bunch of teenagers doing something good, because, unfortunately, today's teens don't usually have a good rep. What do you no. think about that? No, they don't. We talked about that. I was, <coughs> excuse me. When I found it was teenagers coming over to do it, I just, I went berserk. Oh, no, it's going to be a total mess. They're going to be running to and fro and everything else. And it was totally opposite of what I thought it was going to be. And, again, I just can't say enough about those teenagers. They were just wonderful. And, you know, and it's nice to have it here in Apache Junction, right? Yes, yes, it was, yes. And, again, I, I feel so fortunate to be chosen to have it done. Well, thank you, Ray and Lisa, for uh, being part of this program. And uh, you'll be seeing this all over Facebook. So thank you. What's Facebook? <laughs> <laughs> he knows. You. Thank you for coming out and taking pictures and being there when I had to work. <laughs> yeah, Lisa, you are a, you are a, a you, got, you got your own ladle. I know you. It's like, well, thank you, Lisa, and thank you for getting Ray involved. And I, the kids said they much rather do your house than a bigger house. So um, I think they were pleased as well. Work out for everybody then. <laughs> this is Karen Sunt with Talking the Five, and in AJ or Apache Junction, Arizona. Thank you.